the reason that we write about um, how to hire a business development manager is because quite often businesses get it wrong. Right. They put the, the obvious things in an ad, like, you know, we need someone to go out there and, and win its new customers. But, but oftentimes that, like, that's just a part of it. It's, it's a small part of it. It's, it's a very important part of it. But you've got to think about your existing customers and, and the relationship and how this new person is going to impact on the relationship of your existing customers. And, and that, that's just not thought of. You could lose more than you gain by getting the wrong person on board because they can knock on a few doors and win a few bits of, of new business. But if, they, if they're not aligned with you, if they're not aligned culturally, if they don't, if they don't have the same feel as you, then, then you can put the whole, the whole thing at risk. That's why we talk to clients about this. It's not just the marketing piece. You know, marketing and sales are now joined at the hip. It's about nurturing the relationship very early on with the client and then be, being able to bring in the BDM, the, the business development manager, into that relationship so that the whole thing feels seamless and it feels like like you as a business.